Remember you're ready, go ahead. This is a fake microphone. Tony. Tony, what were the feelings today hey, coming sweet. in after yesterday? Uh, I was excited. I think I did some stuff on the range last night and then this morning it felt good coming in. I hit the ball well today. So, you know, I think just the feelings and getting comfortable and then a couple of little swing things that kind of creep up once in a while when you get into pressure situations, I was able to manage better. And, uh, you know, I was, I was happy. I was proud, I think. What do you, you know, take away from this performance? Uh, really just the ability to continue to improve. I think more than anything, you know, I got a sense to be able to hit a lot of, you know, high quality shots under, you know, what is a pressure situation for me. So uh, that's encouraging and shows that the work you're doing, you know, holds up when it counts. And then from there, you just got to find the little things that allow you to keep things going and not derail the round. And, and I think just small stuff, but I, you know, technique wise, we're coming on. How do you take that into Monday with the U.S. Open qualifier and then your tournaments through the season? Well, it's playing? it's a process. Like I always say, this, you know, Todd knows this. We talked before about it, but was mostly this is in some ways I treat it like when I started playing. When you can practice something every day of your life, and it's like that's what you're doing, then you can really attack it and improve, like real improvement, not just go out there and you know, play each day. I mean, you're really concentrating on certain areas of your game and, and putting a ton of focus and, and that can improve. And I improved from Punta Cana to here in the putting, chipping. I mean, just some of the stuff that I saw that I was nowhere near at the level. And I, and I improved a lot there. And it's good to see the work and the technique hold up. And then we'll attack the next area and the next area. And hopefully you can get to a point where you're happy with you know the product you're putting out there. Do you think more of the good shots that you hit today, or do you think of like the drives on three and four that kind of cost you? Yeah, I mean, I think I find I mean I hit so many good shots today that I mean I I kind of know that the driver is going to be the ability to go low because you're going to have to put yourself in position to attack you know the pins consistently. So I think you found the next step and what we're going to be working on. But um, I think that's more of a just your ability to keep your misses small. Out here, golf is a game of misses. It really, your ability to just keep making par with your misses is the key and not give away two shots just randomly like I did this week. And um, that'll be something I'll work very hard on, you know, for the next time. Tony, the back nine yesterday was your undoing. Today you played first and make the turn even par. How, can you quantify how much better your back nine was today as compared to yesterday? Yeah, quite a bit different. But like I said, this game is very, I mean, it's small when it comes to your ability to improve from even one day to the next or one week or one month. You can really make uh, a ton of improvement with the right technique or practice. I mean, it's, it's like a puzzle. If you can figure it out, you can really improve. It's just, you know, you gotta go try and dissect it and figure it out. And if you can, then, you know, you can shoot scores that you're proud of. I saw you getting a little advice from Nick Faldo over here. You're making your way up. What did he have to say? Oh, he's talking golf. He's, I think he knows a little bit about the golf swing, so I think we may listen to him a little bit. He's got some good tips. I'm what did your call partner later. say to you during the match yesterday and today? You're out. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, it was, it was great. I think, you know, Scotty, I've played with a bunch, so I think Scotty knows, you know, my abilities, and so it was it was fun to play, you know, with Dylan, and he at the end just talked about, and you, know, you keep going, you got a ton of game, and some good stuff like that, and it makes you feel good as a player. All right, thank you guys. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Absolutely. You want to bring him over here? Or? Yeah, I'll bring him over there. I'll bring him to you. Get to yeah. I know you want to do oh, some yeah, things. Did you want to eat? You can go do it. I mean, oh, uh, did you have more media? Did you want to sign autographs? I want more media. Okay. Uh, autographs? I, I signed a bunch. Oh, okay. actually, I'll come over here. Yeah. Whatever you want to do. I'll If I sign, if you just come in. We had a good time. Hard work for sure. Just not here today. Yes, sir. No, it's all right. I'm sorry.